Aloha. So again, so this is Rimar Santiago or commonly known as Marty. So today I'm going to talk about a notable person who was the founder of Kamehameha Dynasty. And of course, the king um, I want, I'm going to talk about is King Kamehameha the Great. So as I said a while ago, so Kamehameha the Great or King Kamehameha uh, the First was the, um, the Hawaiian conqueror. And of course, the king who united the Hawaiian Islands and also the founder of Kamehameha Dynasty, and of course, the first ruler of the Kingdom of Hawaii. So he was raised and born around uh, 1953 during the reign of Ali'i Nui. He is the high chief, and of course, died on the year um, 18, uh, 1819. So where he was born in Kohala on the northern tip of the big island. So he was raised in secrecy in Kohala because of the death, uh, death threat from Alapa Inui. So his burial ground remained a secret up to this day. So, yeah. So now let's talk about his uh, personal life. Yep. So King Kamehameha the Great, he was married multiple uh, women. So as part of the culture, because um, as part of the culture before, and his favorite wife is named. Kaahumanu. So that's the first picture. So the, she is a Queen Kaahumanu, the favorite wife of King Kamehameha the first. And of course, his notable children were um, Liho Liho, or commonly known as King Kamehameha uh, the second. And of course, we have uh, Kawi Kio Oli, or known as King Kamehameha the second. Yep. And now, Let's talk about um, some of the facts about um, King Kamehameha the first. So he was born on the night of a Haley comet, and of course he was born, uh, first monarch of the first uh, of the Hawaiian monarchy. And of course he was trained by uh, Keku Haupio as a high-ranking warrior, and of course gained reputation as an excellent warrior. And now, so let's talk about the legend of the Naha Stone. I think this is one of um, the legend that many people want to know about. So this is, um, as you can see in the picture right now, so this is a 2.5 ton stone and was used as a test of uh, royal strength in the ancient times. So the ancient legend said that uh, whoever could move the stone, this stone right over here on the picture, could conquer and unite the islands. And as a 14 years old um, boy, King Kamehameha the Great is said to have moved the stone and later fulfilled his destiny to conquer and unite um, the islands of Hawaii. Which I think, yep, so that's the island of Hawaii, which I think is one of his um, notable achievements. Yeah, so he he brought um, peaceful to the um, to each island. Yep. So that's all uh, for uh, this presentation about King Kamehameha the First or King Kamehameha the Great. Mahalo.